balls out wide with Moreno, plays it into the middle to Ramsey, who's going to run at the defence. There's a big hole for him to go through, and what a finish. McGinn tries the pass, it's blocked by Taylor. He's going to move forwards. Has he got a pass on? No, he goes into the box, but now he does, and there's Ramsey to tuck it home. Ball is with Bailey, he tries to go forwards. It's tackled by Moreno. Bailey plays it forward, Zaniolo's in the box. What a finish by the Italian. Ball comes out to Chambers. He's going to try and play it forward. Goes to Zaniolo in the box. Has he got a pass? He has. It's Douglas Louise. What a finish from Douglas Louise. There are some fantastic Football Manager Tactics creators out in the Football Manager community. In today's video, I've taken one of the tactics that was popular in FM23 and I'm going to put it through its paces in FM24 to see if it can stand up to the brand new match engine. In today's video, I'm going to be looking at the 4141 goal machine, which is a Zaz Blue 4.0 tweak. I'm going to run a single season sim with Aston Villa to see how it gets on. I'm going to break the tactic down, but if you're familiar with the tactic already you might want to skip past this part and go straight to the result but if you want to see the tactic and all of its instructions feel free to pause the video at any point if you need to jot anything down there will be a link to this tactic in the description down below right then starting off at the back we have a sweeper keeper set to support you have a back four that's an inverted wing back two ball playing defenders and another inverted wing back you then have a roaming playmaker on the left, a winger on support, two shadow strikers, and another winger on support. And then at the top of the pitch, you will have an advanced forward. Its tactical style is set to custom. Its mentality is positive. Its in possession will look like this. Its in transition will look like this. Its out of possession will look like this. As I said, this is a tactic that was very popular for FM23 and scored some impressive results. But let's find out, how did it get on with Aston Villa in FM24? So the single season sim has finished. It's the 1st of June 2024. Let's show you how Aston Villa have got on. Starting off with the competitions, the Carabao Cup. First tick, they have won a cup. FA Cup, they were knocked out in the fourth round by Manchester City. In the Europa Conference League, another tick. They have won another competition as they finished champions of the Conference League. In the Premier League, they would finish in fifth place on 66 points from 38 games. If we break that down just a little bit more, we can see that they have qualified for the Europa League next season. They have played 38 games. They won 20. They drew 6. Lost 12 had a goal difference of 25 and finished on 66 points, which was just three points behind Arsenal, who finished in the Champions League places. Ollie Watkins would finish runner-up in the league in terms of goals on 23. We have a little look at the squad to see how the rest of them perform then. Ollie Watkins would finish on 59 appearances and 31 goals. He would chip in with 10 further assists. Jacob Ramsey would get 19 goals and 7 assists. Douglas Louise, 15 assists and 16 goals. And then Tielemann, 17 assists and 12 goals. Further down, McGinn would get 8 goals and 14 assists. We look at the data hub to break down some of the data. In terms of attacking, this is the numbers. So, 2.42 goals per game. Non-penalty XG is 2.18. Shots per game, 13.66. Shots on target ratio, 46.82. Dribbles per game, 19.05. Cross completion, 13.39. Pass completion ratio, 86.55. Fouls against per game, 11.13. In terms of the defending numbers, we have 1.76 conceded per game, 1.9 expected goals against per game. Tackles attempted, 29.11. Tackles won. 75.05 interceptions per game 20.97 blocks per game 4.42 clearances per game 8.05 fouls made per game 16.47 there is a bit more data on this screen if you want to have a look at that feel free to pause it and we are going to move back to the competitions for the roundup so Carabao Cup winners, Conference League winners, finished fifth in the Premier League is quite impressive. I think that this tactic actually really has the potential to go on and do great things in the right hands by the right players. Plug them in. You're going to have a fantastic run in FM24 with this 
tactic right then if you're still with me at this point of the video firstly a big thank you secondly if you could hit the like and subscribe button to help the channel really would appreciate it you don't want to miss out on any of the content that's coming now fm24 is out there will be plenty of content in the coming days uh, before you go don't forget to check out the rest of the channel there is other things such as hints tips tutorials tactics there's something for everybody on the channel but for this one i'm going to leave it there big thank you for watching i'll see you on another video very soon